Oh, wow. Get ready, drama and suspense fans. This weekend is an all-new episode of the Bounce TV hit Saints and Sinners. The highly rated series is now in its fifth season, and I got to talk to D.C. area native Trey Chaney and also Jasmine Burke about filming during the pandemic and what we can expect throughout this season. Trey and Jasmine, welcome to Great Day Washington. We're so excited to have you here in D.C. as people invite you into their homes every week. Congratulations, first of all, fifth season of Saints and Sinners. What's it like to be back again? It's wonderful. It's it, it's so exciting to be a part of this show that is bringing so much entertainment and joy to people every Sunday for the past five years. And um, we're just incredibly grateful and thrilled to be back. Yeah, and just to, you know, piggyback off of Jasmine, it, it's it's just amazing, like she said, to, to be on Saints and Sinners, you know, Bounce TV, five seasons, a lot of shows, don't make it to five seasons. Right. So just to, you know, be working with incredible actors and actresses such as Jasmine Burke, Clifton Powell, Vanessa Bell Calloway, it's amazing. And I'm just honored to be playing this character, Kendrick Murphy. That and people tune into your show more than a lot of network shows <laughs> at this time. They are coming to seek you yeah. out. But Jasmine, you said joy. When I was watching the trailer for this next season, I was like, that looks intense. It looks very yeah. intense. What can we expect for this season? It's very intense. <laughs> Our showrunner and writer, Nigel Campbell, and the entire writing team, they, I don't know how they come up with these things. I have no <laughs> idea what inspires these twists and turns. They really seem borderline fantasy, but yeah. it, it's not yeah. too far, but it's just far enough to where you're like, how did that happen? Like, <laughs> <laughs> and um, so it's just it's great to work with such creatives like Nigel Campbell and, and the whole team. And like you said, it's very intense and we feel it as we're watching it. I tell you, I uh, Trey can probably answer for himself, but when I'm watching the show, I'm watching like I didn't even shoot the show. I'm watching like a fan like what? Wow. And right. the music, the music is so incredible. It adds to all mm -hmm. the drama intensity and the build up. And um, yeah, I mean, just just from the trailer, you could see exactly. Uh, oh, oh, we're not teasing you. That's exactly <laughs> That's how it happened. <laughs> yeah. Trey, you're a not lot in of the story, a, a lot of the storylines, you know, I think, well, I definitely know the fans relate to this show. You know, when you have this family and when you think about the church everybody that's going to this church you know they might seem like they're one way but outside of the church they're they're a totally different person you know and, and like jasmine was saying you know the different cliffhangers the twist and turns and and definitely with season five of saint and sinners this year have been one of the best seasons you all have really it's going to be so much revealed in this season that okay. a lot of the fans were curious to, to to know about. OK, we finally get our questions answered here. Uh, yes. And then we and yeah. then we uh, put a whole other pile of questions for you to ponder upon. <laughs> okay. Good. Good. Yeah, that's true. Well, as we were doing this interview, when we were starting, we said, you know, from the comfort of your own home, you're now doing the media tour. What was it like to shoot with the restrictions that we're facing during the pandemic shoot this fifth season? You know, the only difference really was just being tested um, yeah. a few times yeah. a week and having to wear your masks in the common areas around everybody. Other than that, it was it was business as usual. Wow. And, and that's one thing that, that I'm, I'm I felt very comfortable, you know, with my cast and Bounce TV and Swirl Films for just making sure that all of the cast members, all of the crew members, anybody that was stepping foot on set was tested. And, you know, thank God everybody's, you know, test came back negative and we were just able, you know, to to feel safe in a safe environment on set working with our different, you know, cast and crew members. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. We've kind of figured it out now, right? Thank you yeah. both. You've made me more excited for the season even than before this. So thank you for joining us and letting us in on a little bit of what we'll see this year. Thank you, guys. Thank, thank you. you.